this is um, an initial test of the <clears throat> ISDT smart charger model SC608 so far I'm pretty impressed it's lightweight small um, ready to be powered by a big lipo and I do have a much bigger one than this um, to to use at the field but and I also have an um, external AC charger um, adapter inverter <laughs> whatever to use it at home uh, but anyway um, it's really really nice you can change the brightness of the screen um, <clears throat> the volume of the beeps and all that kind of stuff as you can see right now I'm charging a, a 4 cell 1300 uh, LiPo with a 3 cell 2200 LiPo um, seems to be no problem um, it's been going for a little while and you can see um, it tells you the percent that it's been charged so far uh, the rate at which it's charging 1.3 amps that's what I set it to um, the time that it has been going and of course each cell um, voltage currently and um, if I switch the menu um, I get internal resistances uh, I mean all sorts of information here um, and also what the input battery voltage is um, which input battery voltage which is the 3 cell um, you can see it's uh, going down it's 10.3 10, 10 not sure this video is going to work it keeps lagging on me um, and then what the total voltage is and wattage of uh, the destination charge and also the the temperature I'm not really sure where it's getting that information from um, if I had to guess, I would say it's the internal um, temperature of the charging unit because um, it is getting a little bit warm, but nothing to be concerned of. Um, and I'll show you uh, after this, I'll, I'll edit and put in a video um, clip of the boot process of the charger where it does a self test each time, and the fan, the internal fan. Uh, runs pretty fast during that, that period um, so yeah if it was getting hotter than it wants to be it would just run the fan and it's not really doing that much right now because it's not it's barely warm cool it says 55c <laughs> uh, celsius 